An 18 year old in Philadelphia is charged with the murder of a Temple University police officer who was shot over the weekend. Dre Clark joins us live from the officer's memorial with the latest in this case. Good morning, Dre. Mitch, good morning. Officer Christopher Fitzgerald was very much involved in the Philadelphia community, so he was known and loved by many. He was also a husband, father of four, and the son of a former police chief. This memorial you see here behind me is a reflection of the grief that people are feeling here in Philadelphia. Uh, again, Officer Fitzgerald, very well known. His family members saying that the love and support they're receiving from people all across the city certainly is a big help uh, as they suffer with his tragic and sudden loss here. Uh, let's take you to that scene on Saturday night where the officer was shot. The Philadelphia District Attorney says Officer Fitzgerald was shot multiple times while trying to arrest 18-year-old Miles Pfeffer for robbery. The DA also saying Officer Fitzgerald was on the ground bleeding and that's when Pfeffer allegedly tried to go through his pockets and steal the officer's gun. Police say after the shooting, uh, Officer Fitzgerald, Pfeffer then ran down the block and conducted a carjacking nearby. Officer Fitzgerald was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Now, a massive manhunt was launched to find Pfeffer and Sunday morning. U.S. Marshals and local police tracked him to his family's home in neighboring Bucks County, which is not far from Philadelphia. Temple University's vice president, President of Public Safety said this in a statement. Officer Fitzgerald gave his life to selflessly serve and defend this community. The courage and bravery he displayed highlights the day-to-day -day sacrifice made by our Temple University police officers to keep our community safe. Officer Fitzgerald is the first Temple University police officer killed in the line of duty, and his death comes as Philadelphia has a been struggling to try and get a handle on the gun violence happening here in the city. The Philadelphia Inquirer noting that since 2020, 131 people have been shot and 16 killed within a quarter mile of Temple University's main campus here in North Philadelphia. Uh, back here live now and here, the Officer Down Memorial page, which honors all police officers dying in the line of duty across the country says so far this year, 13 police officers have been killed in the line of duty, seven dying from gunfire, and Pennsylvania has the highest number of police officers killed so far this year with three, all of them dying after being shot and killed. Mitch, Adrian. Uh, Dre, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.